hi guys you're welcome back to my channel in today's video tutorial i'm going to be showing you guys how you can transfer money using your access bank mobile app so guys it's very easy to do if you want to know how to do this just make sure you follow me to the end of this video and also if this video is helpful to you please consider liking subscribing and leaving a comment as that will help grow this channel so guys let's get started so guys like i said i'm going to be showing you guys how you can transfer money using the access small app using the access bank mobile app so guys you're going to be able to transfer money to any kind of bank even if the bank is not an access bank so guys i'm going to show you guys how you can do that so guys now the first step you need to take is to make sure you have the access bank mobile app into your phone so guys if you don't have the app in your phone for you to get it you have to go over to your play store if you're using an android device then you go over to app store if you're using an iphone device or an ios device then you download and install it from there so guys in case you don't know how to download and install the app into your phone i've already made a video on that on how you can actually download and install it what you're going to do is that after you're done watching this video go over to the description of this video you're going to see a link there a video link there tap on the link there you'll be able to watch and learn how you can download and install the code correct access bank mobile app into your phone there are actually many access bank mobile app on play store and app store but you have to get the authentic one the correct one that is being endorsed by access bank so guys if you want to know that just make sure you watch the video so guys now once you've gotten the app what you have to do now is to tap on it to open it so let me tap on it to open it right away so guys now you can see the access bank app is opening so guys once you open up your access bank mobile app this is what you're going to be faced with this is what the interface looks like so guys here you're required to sign in and you're required to sign in with your password so guys you can see where it is written password so let me tap on it now to impute my password so guys now you can see i've imputed my password so what i have to do now is to tap on where it is written sign in so let me tap on it so guys now you can see i'm signed into the access bank mobile app as you can see here here is the home page of the access bank mobile app so guys now for you to transfer money to any kind of bank that is not access bank what you have to do now is to tap on that place that you can see other bank transfer you can see there let me tap on it so you see it so guys you can see there the arrow is pointing at it you can see where it is written other banks so guys what you have to do now is to tap on it but in case the person you want to transfer the money is using access bank what you have to do is to tap on where it is written access transfers you can see there the arrow is pointing at it you can see there what you have to do is to tap on it but guys in case on your home page you can see these options here you can see these access transfers and also other bank transfers here at the top of your phone what you have to do now is to tap on the icon that is written menu you can see the menu icon there the menu page the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it now right away so guys after that what you have to do now is to tap on transfers you can see there that's the second option so let me tap on it so guys now you can see the options there those options we saw on our home page so guys you can see the feature there you can see the first feature there access transfer let me point it out so you see it so guys you can see it access transfer and you can see other banks transfer that's the second option so guys now you can see the options here so guys now in case you don't see it on your home page you can come over to this menu page to find it so guys now let me go back now to the home page to tap on other banks transfer so the person i want to transfer money to is using uba bank so what i have to do now is to tap on the option where it is written other banks transfers you can see there the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it so guys now you can see where it has brought us to over here you have to impute the details of the person that you want to transfer the money to like you have to impute the bank name you have to impute the account number the amount of money you want to send and also why you're sending the money so guys now that's what you need to feel so guys now first of all let me impute the name of the bank for you to do that you have to tap on that drop down icon you can see where the arrow is pointing at you can see where the arrow is pointing at you have to tap on that drop down icon so let me tap on it so guys now you can see the list of banks right here what you have to do now is to scroll through it to find the name of the bank or you can either search for the name of the bank there at the top you can see that search icon there at the top the arrow is pointing at it you can see the search icon right there just tap on it there you'll be able to search for the bank so guys let me stop let me search for it right away um, let me search for united bank for africa so guys now you can see immediately i typed united bank for africa the bank popped up you can see there at the top uba so let me tap on it now to select it so guys now you can see united bank for africa which is uba has been selected so guys now the next step you have to take now is to impute the beneficiary account number the account number of the person that you want to send the money to so guys let me impute it right away so let me tap on it there so guys what you have to do now is to use the keypad to type in the account number so let me copy and paste the account number right here so guys now you can see i've imputed the account number what you have to do now is to confirm the name of the person so guys let's wait for a few seconds the name is going to appear 
so guys now you can see the name of the person who owns the account has appeared there you can see down below it's just below the beneficiary account number you can see there the arrow is pointing at it you can see it there so guys what you will always do is that whenever you impute the account number just make sure you confirm that the account number tallies with the account name make sure that the name appearing here is the name of the person that you want to send the money to so guys make sure that the account number is the same as the account name so guys after you've confirmed that the name of the account is right they can go ahead now to impute your amount so guys now for you to impute your amount you have to tap on where it is written amount you can see there the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it so guys let me impute my amount right away So guys now you can see i've imputed the amount i want to send hundred thousand so guys now the next step you have to take now is to impute the narration the narration is the reason why you are actually sending the money let me say for instance you want to pay for your rent you can go ahead to impute rent as the narration or maybe you want to pay for the clothes that you bought you can go ahead to impute clothes or maybe you bought provisions from someone you want to pay for provision you can go ahead to impute provision as the narration you can just impute anything as the narration in as much as you're okay with it so guys let me just impute something um let me impute it's paid so guys now you can see i've imputed i've typed in paid as my narration you can see there the arrow is pointing at it i've typed in paid so guys now the next step you have to take now after imputing the name of the bank the account number and confirming the name of the person on the account number and also the amount and narration what you have to do right away now is to tap on where it is written proceed you can see down there the arrow is pointing at it so guys let me tap on it right away so guys over here what you have to do now is to review the transaction that you want to carry out so guys you have to confirm the name you have to confirm the amount so guys can see there you can see all that is written here the bank the narration the commission and total debit so guys this is the total debit you're going to be having so guys now you can see the commission right there 53 naira 75 kubu that's because you're transferring to other bank that is not access bank but if you're transferring to an access bank using the access bank mobile app you're not going to pay any commission the commission will be zero naira so guys you're transferring from access bank to access bank your commission will be zero naira you will not be paying any commission you will not be charged any commission it will be zero naira but if you're transferring from access bank to other bank you're going to be charged a fee so guys now you can see the fee is 53 naira 75 kobu so guys what you have to do right the winner after you're done cross checking all of this what you have to do is you tap on where it is written pay you can see down there below the arrow is pointing at it so guys let me tap on this right away so guys over here this is where you need to enter your transaction pin your four digit pin that you normally use to authenticate your bank transaction so guys without imputing that pin your transaction will not be successful so the pin is usually that four digit pin your transaction pin is usually your atm card pin but in case yours is different from that what you have to do is to impute it right away so guys let me impute mine already so guys i have imputed it now you can see it's loading automatically so guys now let's just wait for a few seconds so guys now you can see success transfer request successful so guys this is what you're going to see to be sure that your transaction was successful you're going to see that right up down there so guys you're going to see it down there so guys now for you to close now what you have to do now is to scroll downward the tap on close so guys let me tap on close right away so guys now you can see immediately i tapped on close it took me to the home page in case i want to carry out any other transaction so guys now i've been able now to show you guys how you can use the access more app how you can use the access bank mobile app to carry out transfers to transfer money from one person to the other so guys now i've been able now to show you so guys i've come to the end of this video and i believe you got value from it if you did make sure you like subscribe and leave a comment and also if you're new to our youtube channel don't forget to hit the bell notification so that whenever i release new videos like this you're gonna get notified see you on our next upload bye bye Peace.